After two seasons away from coaching, Stephen Robichaux is back at Destrehan, accepting his former position as the head football coach. Well, just, just a ton of emotions, you know, uh, when you're around a program for as much as long as I've been here and, and be able to get the opportunity to come back to a place that you love and a job that you love, or just, just, just ecstatic about what's going on and just really excited about coming back and hopefully getting things done here. The reason I left in the first place, obviously, was for family reasons. And I uh, actually spent a little time with the family. My daughter was a cheerleader, got to see her cheer. And uh, had that burning desire still, just watching them and watching St. Charles Catholic play. And uh, my, uh, my wife, about uh, three weeks ago, came to me and said, you need to get back into it. And uh, I kind of said, no, I, you know, I don't think so. It's family and it's time for you and that kind of thing. And she said, no. She says, uh, you know, we're going to be okay. She says, that's your passion. That's what you love. She says, you need to get back into it. So uh, call Mr. Weber right away and uh, things worked out and uh, here we are. During the two seasons that Robichaux was working with the St. Charles Parish School Board, the Wildcats went 5-15, and 15, including losing eight straight to close out the 2011 season. Extremely tough. You know, we were, uh, uh, you know, less fortunate even my last year. We ended up, we were 5-6 and six and that had a very good year. And then, uh, you know, and it kind of fell on, on some, some lean years there and, and still had guys that really meant a lot to me. And, uh, you know, uh, I was really excited the opportunity to come back, felt sorry for those guys and just, Hopefully that we can come back here and, and hopefully get some things done here. As for what he told his players in his first meeting as their new head coach, I told him that you know I'm not the answer, not the answer for everything. You know my I, I, what I bring here is a uh, a guy that's going to work on the little things. We're going to try to get back to being real disciplined, uh, have an identity on offense and defense, and uh, and that they were the key. They were the key to come back and doing things right and. Uh, if you're doing things right and you have a good players, good things happen to you, and that's all we want to do around here. One of Robichaux's top returning players will be wide receiver Ricky Jefferson, who suffered a season-ending knee injury in Week 5 this past season against Dutchtown. Jefferson's older brother, LSU's Jordan Jefferson, spent four seasons under Robichaux and was the quarterback on the 15-0 2007 Class 5A state championship team, something Ricky Jefferson remembers well. I just know what type of guy he is. I know what he cares about the program, and you know, I just, I just, I, I love him. He's a good head coach. You know, he has our best interests. When you heard about it, what was your first reaction? I think I heard about it last night, and they had some buzz going around. You know, people, people talk a lot, and I was, I was excited. You know, to get back to the old way we used to be. You know, not, I didn't disrespect the coach Stroud, but you know, just to see Destran on the right track and how it used to be. You know, as a, a successful program. Winning, t winning team, basically. We were pretty excited. I think his speech really touched me. As a football player, you know, I have stepped my game up a lot, you know, coming off the injury. And all our teammates, they felt the same way. They, they know we're not as talented as we were before, but we know we have to put in that hard work and do what we have to do to be successful just for him. For RiverParishFootball.com, I'm Eric Ritchie.